Yang Bao's visit to Merida's wooden railway was coming to an end. We shall miss you, said Merida, now uh, promoted to the wooden railway. Soon, we'll soon see, find out. We'll soon discover and f figure out that the ornament Merida now runs the HO railway. But anyways, then she turned to the engines. Your work is good, and I'm proud of all of you, but you need help. A diesel is all that's available. A Brio diesel. Ahem. <clears throat> oh, wait, no, never mind. But never mind, you fixed it. What does that mean, said Henry? That means this diesel is difficult, said James. And he was. He came in very loudly, and all the engines knew that wasn't a good sign. He stopped right in front of everyone. Not bad. I've seen worse. At least you're all clean. The engines glared. It's not your fault. But Meredith should scrap you and get engines like me. A fill of oil and touch on the starter and I'm off. No bother, no waiting. They have to fuss around you for hours before you're ready to work. The engines were furious. Next day they held an indignation meeting. Disgraceful. Disgusting. Despicable. To say such things to us, cried Anthony and Diesel, is to be is to teach them a lesson we be one. Now how do we do it? The chance came sooner than expected. An inspector was was making final adjustments to the diesel. The wind tugged his toupee. The diesel was ready. Look at me, James and Yang Bao. Now I'll show you something. Then it happened. Shaking and spluttering, the diesel stopped. Meanwhile, the inspector was looking for his hat. James and Yang Bao pushed him back to the shed. Me hat, I mean, me wig, cried Ringo. You sucked it to your air intake. Bother your hat. Bother your wig. The heavy trains do out. You'll have to take it, James. Young Bao, will you help, please? Thank you, ma'am, he said. I do, I like a nice long run on my last day. The engines were ready. Gordon will take over from halfway, so get the train to the station. Good luck. Now, thanks. Thank you, ma'am. Now for a nice... Nice, long, smooth ride. I'm ready when you are, said James. The cavalcade... <clears throat> the cavalcade swung past the diesel. The diesel was cross. Well, too fucking bad. They charged out of the station and then around the bend and beyond. Hello, you're early. That's one of the headlamp for old Diesel. James says, Henry says he's sick as boiler sludge and sulking in the shed. Shed. Serves him right for saying we're out of date. And Gordon backed down onto the train. Next day, all the engines gave a final goodbye to young Bao. Come back and see us soon, they all said. And you're always welcome on my Chinese railway. Then he puffed away. What about Diesel? Well, he slipped out while no one was looking, even though everyone was right in front of him. But he left two things behind, a rather nasty smell and a battered bowler wig. I miss him already. Anybody have anything to say about Young Bell? Yeah, I got something to say. Young Bell is gone. <laughs> Uh-oh. Look, Harold wet his pants. Harold wet his pants. Mommy, mommy. He's never going to hear the end of this. <laughs> I know.